Welcome to Graft. In this video, we will take a look at how you can undo a rasterization in Adobe Illustrator. So, as I've said in my other videos before, rasterizing is a destructive process. So, it means that you may not be able to reverse it once you've saved the document or made too many changes. However, there is a way you can undo rasterize in Illustrator. You can use the Control Command Z option. But that is li limited to a couple of steps, so if you have too, money, too many, you won't be able to get back. And you'll lose every step you made from the time you rasterized. You, in case you already saved your document when the, doc the object was rasterized, your only option to turn it into a vector is through image trace. So I have this image here when I select it and I go to Window, then I can choose Image Trace. And in this image trace, I can choose how I want to trace it. And in this case, we will choose a high fidelity photo. Now you have all sorts of steps here. Most likely when you start out, your advanced will be, uh, won't be uncollapsed. So you can uncollapse that if you want to. You can play around with the parts, with the corners, uh, the noise. Most of the time I leave it as it is. The only thing I often change is the colors so that I have more colors. But it all depends on your end result. And as you can see, it has now traced the image. And then there's just one step left. And that's going to Object and clicking Expand. Now make sure you check the object in the fill. And then you press OK. And as you can see now, it's not just an image anymore, it's a layer with lots and lots of parts and objects you can play around with. And they're all editable again one by one instead of being one single image which isn't able to be changed. So yeah, the most important thing to remember is that before you rasterize to save your original vector object on a hidden layer, another document, another artboard, just something so you can always go back to the vector, the original vector, and you won't get in trouble with doing this because, you know, the quality after you rasterized it and you make it a vector again using the image trace won't be the same high quality as it was before. Now, if you're rasterizing an object uh, in Illustrator to edit in Photoshop, that's not necessary since you can copy with Control Command C and paste Control Command V the vector objects from Illustrator directly into Photoshop. So this was the video on how to undo rasterize in Illustrator as far as possible. Let me know if you like this tutorial. Be sure to press the thumbs up if you did. Maybe the little bell icon if you want to see more. And I hope to see you in the next one.